so here's something that is really bothering me and I really want to address, you know. Um, here's a picture of people chewing at a Gucci store in Sentin. Now, there's a lot of people their opinion on people who are buying Gucci. So here's something that is really bothering me and I really want to address, you know. takes people seriously based on their perceived levels of wealth so I, I can like I remember a time where I was starting out in business and I used to walk to this organization daily trying to propose what I want to do in this organization and I could not even get through the receptionist for months for months I tried up until I bought my first car an Audi A4 had an iPhone and because of the like the reception can
Who's gonna take me seriously if I rock up wearing a t-shirt? Or sweatpants or a shirt? Like, who's gonna take me seriously? Brands that are actually of quality, they are not even known to the mainstream market because they are not heavily marketed towards us. It's also something that's gatekept by the ultra rich. So Gucci and all these other luxurious people that we think are prestigious, they are not. What we can say about Gucci South Africa is that at least black South Africans put in an effort into dressing up to at least also respectably look decent for where they're going to shop at. That cannot be said about Gucci Paris. This is why even luxury brands back in the days were not even accessible to low class whites. They did not want their brand associated to this or even reduced to this kind of shopping. They wanted to give luxury and opulence to the altery rich befitting their status as rich people this is why also most of these luxury brands were accused of being also made in china the ones that we also deem to be original however you don't have to take my word for it it will be explained soon i'm never buying balenciaga again it's all made in china yeah it is but you know most other designer products are as well no they're not all of the brands say made in france or made in italy yeah but that's not completely true what are you saying that designer brands are just lying to us well yeah kind of i don't believe you they're obviously not allowed to do that well they actually kind of are how so what they do is is they make most of the product in a place like china then as long as they make something small like the lining of the inner soul they're allowed to put made in Italy if they make that in a soul in Italy. So when these luxury brands started to become accessible to the mainstream market, so as... Louis Vuitton, Dior, it's all of them. 
Although I am agreeing with you that China is good at high volume production at a reasonable cost, that does not necessarily mean that the low cost of production will come with high quality materials which will be used to produce the item. Also remember that the main objective of any business is to accumulate profit. So the ability to also cut low production means underpaying workers as well. Because that is what is currently happening to workers who work in factories in China. It also means that you should cut costs of materials which are used in comparison to the past when you would use materials which are sustainable and tells them to take business elsewhere where it's cheaper and productive.